In the beginning of uh, V for Vendetta, both myself and Alan had, had created separately two different concepts that we blended for V. Uh, and they were both about fighting a fascist dictatorship. For me, the, the most important message that ran alongside the concept of anarchy was the element of individuality. Um, the story of Valerie Page, effectively, the central figure who is persecuted and eventually killed in, in the camps. The right of the individual to be individual, to hang on to your individuality, who you are at, the, at, at any cost. Because if you, if you lose sight of who you are as an individual, that is actually when you can become fascistic. If you, if you lose sight of your singularity, that's how you can become seduced into becoming part of a, of a, of, of a, a club. Personally, I've always, I've always had a kind of connection with V because I created the character um, as a person and the way he moved and the way he acted. And I believe in what he believed in. But I don't think the world has changed. The world has not changed. I mean, this is, you know, you, the world has not changed at all. Um, and, and one of the reasons, sadly, for, for, for V's success throughout the world, it's been published everywhere, is because there is always some tyranny. I mean, there is, it, it seems like there is a bottomless pit of, of tyrannies. I hope, I hope somehow people's desire for freedom continues. <laughs>